The Plan, People's Liberation Army Navy, just released a video showing the launch of a new hypersonic missile from a Type 055 cruiser. The missile is likely the Eagle Strike YJ-21. Naval News regular contributor and analyst H.I. Sutton identified the missile as the hypersonic YJ-21 anti-ship ballistic missile, ASBM, based on the CM-401 design. The new missile outwardly resembles the CM-401 design, with the addition of a large booster phase. The CM-401 is roughly analogous to the Iskander missile although its diameter is only 600 mm. It is possible that the new missile is related to the older CM-401 family, although the resemblance may be coincidental. And it may have a smaller diameter. The YJ-21 characteristics are unknown because there has been no official notice of the test launch. The footage, on the other hand, implies a cold-launched, possibly two-stage, missile, implying an ant-ship ballistic missile with HGV. The control surfaces are rather small which means this is likely not an anti-air missile. According to open data, the VLS fitted aboard the Type 55s can accommodate missiles with the following maximum measurements, length of 9 meters and diameter of 0.85 meters. If this missile turns out to be the hypersonic YJ-21, the Type 055 cruisers would arguably become the most heavily armed warships worldwide. The missile was fired from a Type 055 Renhai-class cruiser. With eight ships already in the water, the Chinese Navy's Type 055 Renhai-class cruiser is making waves. It is undoubtedly the most impressive surface combatant in the plan, Chinese Navy, lineup, making it a natural focus of observers. New intelligence suggests that at least two more are under construction in Dalian, China.